Good Friday, everyone. This is meteorologist Dave Snyder at the National Weather Service with Alaska statewide weather. Low pressure moving up across the southwestern side of Alaska and over the eastern Aleutians at 976 millibars. We'll continue to work up some very warm and wet air, and that could mean periods of heavy rain for the Kenai Peninsula and Kodiak Island into Prince William Sound as we go into the weekend. In the meantime, plenty of winds moving across the Arctic coast and the northeastern Brooks Range slopes. That could mean near blizzard conditions at times. That means very poor visibility. Blowing and drifting snow. Not a whole lot of new additional snows expected at this time. That's going to be stronger easterly winds that should continue for many at least until tonight and probably in some cases for the Beaufort Sea Coast until Sunday morning. So plan on poor visibility to continue and again make sure you have a plan if you're going out in the weather for the next uh, couple days. In the meantime, looking southward once again, southerlies will pick up as we head into tonight. Moving across the Kenai Peninsula for the higher terrain areas, the winds will probably pick up to about 30 to 40 miles per hour. You'll notice the difference as we go into the overnight hours. Periods of rain will focus on the wetter side of the Kenai Mountains as usual in Prince William Sound. Watch for some of that to work up toward places like Homer and Seward as we get into the evening and overnight. Out across southwestern Alaska, pockets of rain and snow showers are expected to move across the YK Delta. A stronger, drier easterly wind will shift out from over Norton Sound and be replaced with snow as we get into Saturday there. Winds will be picking up for St. Lawrence Island, the Seward Peninsula, and areas north of the Yukon Valley as you head up into the Kotzebue Sound region as well. Meanwhile, for the Arctic Slope, winds will continue from the east and they will be blustery, producing poor visibility. And again, not a whole lot of precipitation with that. Looking southward, rain's going to continue for Prince William Sound, eastward toward Yakutat. For most of southeast, it looks like a relatively dry Saturday. Watch for some hit and miss rainfall, as usual with southeast. Look for a better chance for wetter weather, though, for the northern part of the Panhandle into Yakutat and Icy Cape, westward toward Prince William Sound. A large part of Cook Inlet will see clouds, but maybe not a whole lot of precipitation until you move southward from the Barrens to Kodiak Island. Around southwestern Alaska, precipitation should start to ease up a little bit and become more showery in nature. Around Norton Sound in Nome, looking northward toward Kotzebue Sound, a better chance for snow showers there and rain and snow showers will be present for most of the Aleutians throughout the weekend. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm meteorologist Dave Snyder. You can always find us online at weather.gov.